So this is the Aromatech Mini. Yeah, and Mini's interesting because they have, they go all the way up to ones that they have you connect to a full HVAC system, you know, the heating and air conditioning systems for buildings. So they, they do like industrial type sense. And uh, yeah, which might explain why their oils that they make will be really strong, which in some cases is good, some cases is bad. Uh, the Noir, I got a Noir there and it didn't make it past the front room. I opened it outside and it just, uh, it's, I call them eye burners. There's certain ones that just make your eyes water and burn. And yeah, that's what it did. So the, the Romotech Noir, I recommend not trying that. Or just remember, they do have like a money back guarantee. If you don't like it, then you can return it. So if you feel like doing that, that might be the way to go. Just remember that um, it, it's strong. So this in here, this is the vanilla bourbon, which that one's kind of nice. Yeah, it smells vanilla and bourbon-ish. So, but like I said, this is meant for like a large, large organizations or large buildings, so like a very large house, because I mean, it has variable speeds. So you can, this is where you connect, you know, you, you power it up like it does. You turn on the, how much you want coming out. You also have a Bluetooth version of this for like 30 bucks or 35 bucks. You can um, get that, which I probably will be doing that. And I'll also be getting some more of these little bottles here. Now this is how, this is this, I couldn't find anything else with a similar thread. So I think they have like proprietary threads. And so what you want to do is for each scent that you have, you want to get a different one of these because mostly because uh, you want to buy, I don't know how, you see how large this is. This is like the only one that they have, the only size. So you put this in, it's going to be a little bit on the bottom. I don't know how it's going to take it all. So you're probably going to end up wanting to um, uh, just put, um, you know, get one of the larger bottles, you pour it in there and then you have it stored on the side. So when you want that one, you put that one out. But yeah, it'll go for, supposed to be able, they said be able to do like a single tiny room at the lowest where it takes like a millimeter a day or something. It's very little, but then, um, yeah. Oh, so anyway, this, uh, they're very, if you look at the cost of it and also the cost of the oils, because one of the things you want to know is that using any non aromatech oils in this will actually void your warranty. I, I, now I understand that because they can't guarantee what other people are putting into their oils. So, you know, if it's, it's just a little hole here, but so if, if it's diffusing something that has, um, heavier oils in there, something wrong with it, you know, it leaves the, a residue which can clog it up. So they specifically design their oils for their own machines. So something to think about. But yeah, so you can have it like this. You can have this one all the way for like a huge, huge house or maybe even uh, uh, an office building. You know, if you're doing sales, something like that, if you want a nice little scent in the back to cover up whatever scents you may have. So yeah, it's, this is meant for like industrial size. Uh, you don't mix water in it. You, you, um, you just put the oils in by itself. They have a cleaner too that you can have, um, which in the instructions, they just say, just go ahead and use a rubbing alcohol. So you fill the little, little bottle up here with rubbing alcohol. And so, yeah, these are about 650 each right now. So for each cent, you want to get a separate bottle so you don't mix them or you can use part, swap it out and use them put in a different scent when you feel like it but yeah so it's quite the uh quite the system here so you want to look at the cost of this and the cost of their oils go there to their website remember their oils are you know if you don't like them you can get your money back maybe trade for something else so you can uh, try out the various ones all i can recommend is i i really recommend against noir it it it's i what i call eye burners it's a tough one but uh but yeah Vanilla bourbon, not bad at all. It's just, uh, I think you need like a larger amount to be able to do it, you know, to be able to fit it into the bottle there. Because I don't see how a tiny bottle like this would even almost be reachable. Because it only feel like a little layer on the bottom. 
So yeah, that's the review that I came up with. I was trying to find something that um, I tried all kinds of other clever ways to write it up or something and just decided to do it like this. So yeah, check out the cost of the machine, the cost of the oils, and then decide if it's something that you want to work with. And for a small home, I, I really can't recommend it if it's a small home because just it's it's meant it it's definitely meant for a large area so anyway that's my review and um hope this helps thanks